one and only dad to bat. How are you tonight, Dad? I'm great. Thanks for having me today, Susan. So, come on, what are you doing here? To watch the fight, and uh, I'm back to be KFC, you know, to, to win more belts. So how happy are you that you're back to BKFC? The fans really missed you. Right, you know, I, I never, I really never left. It's just all about negotiation. So uh, now that I'm happy that I'm back because I'm gonna get the fight that I want. So I'm gonna move up in weight and, and fight the champion. Because like I said, I came to Bare Knuckle to win multiple weight class and be a multiple world champion, you know? That, that's what challenged me and that's what motivates me. So, can you share with our viewers who might be the next prospect for you that you're going to be fighting then? I'm, uh, like I said, I told David I want Palomino and David said he's going to give it to me. And that's what challenged me and that's what motivates me. Because I want to fight him because he's been talking a lot of trash and because he thinks I'm a 135 pounder and I'm moving up to bigger guys. Look, bigger, the bigger they are, the, the harder they fall. So, you know, we were talking off camera a little bit about that. Explain to our viewers why for you it doesn't matter what weight class you fight at because you're ready to just crush everybody. Because bare knuckle is a new sport. And with, with, with bare knuckle, you can't, re, you know, it's not wrestling where weights really matter. I don't have to pick the guy up. This is, has to do with punching and with the fist. And like I said, my fists are just as hard as his fists. So that's all that matters with no gloves involved. So, you know, that's why weight don't really matter much. It's all about skill level then. I, I like to fight guys that's undefeated. You know, not guys that's already lost, guys that he already been beaten. You know what I mean? That's why I want to fight Palomino, because he's undefeated. I'm going to give him his first loss. You know, fans might need to understand that your culture is really a culture of warriors because you fought for so much. Can you talk a little bit about that? Because you are from Vietnam, and many Americans do not understand that you may not even had food when you right. were growing up there. You know, like Vietnamese people, we have struggled all of our life. We, are, we have fighting blood in all of us. That's why we never give up, no matter the size is it. You know what I mean? We fight giants all the time, you know? So that's what was in my blood. We never give up and we always go for the biggest fight possible. Before we go, is there anything else would you would like to add tonight, Tad? I want to thank all my fans for their love and follow. Stay tuned. And, and like I said, watch me do the impossible. A lot of people doubt me. But look, when they doubt me against Bedford, they're going to doubt me against Luis Papoon. I'm going to prove them wrong every time. It's all up here, guys.